Hi guys, as promised in the first video, we're back here on Saddleworth Moor. Looking why the Maverick Mini wouldn't let me calibrate it at all. Kept refusing time and time again. I've got two inklings what it might be. Let's take a look. So as you can see guys, the compass needs calibrating. So let's have a go. And hopefully this time it's gonna do it. Okay, on its end. Calibration is complete, so that rounds out rules out the first theory I had. And uh, I can hear you asking, What's the first theory? Well, I'll show you what the first theory was. So, the first theory was this building, but it has something quite unusual on the top. And that something unusual is home MOS telecommunications tower, it radiates. FM and DAB radio across all of Greater Manchester, uh, parts of Derbyshire, North Yorkshire and East Yorkshire and I'm right outside it, I'm flying outside it so that rules out my first theory which brings me to my second theory which makes me look a bit of an idiot if it's true and I'm almost 100% sure now that it is true the reason why it wouldn't calibrate was because of my mistake, shall we say. Okay guys, it's asking me to uh, calibrate again. Um, I mean, exactly the same scenario as what I was when I flew the Maverick Mini over the moors last time. Um, and that's sat it foolishly, shall I say, sat in the back of my car. Let's calibrate it and see if it will calibrate. It did rotate horizontally the first time. The problem was when it was uh, rotating vertically, it came up with an error. And as you can see, calibration failed. So there's where the mystery is. It wasn't the fact that I was flying just less than a mile away from home moss telecommunications tower it was because i was sat in the back of my car with my tailgate up trying to see shield from the sun until next time